They think, oh, librarians just stamp books and shush people. Uh, but we do a few other things as well. And so getting an MLIS not only got me the credentials on paper, but far more importantly sort of inculcated me into the ethos of librarianship, our professional values, but also some of the, the hard practical skills as well, like an opportunity to learn how do we organize information, um, how do we help people with a reference interview. And so the MLIS gave me a chance to explore those things and then pursue a career I really enjoy. I feel like every time I emailed a faculty person, I would hear back within about a day, maybe a day and a half max. If you've ever spent any time in the academy, to get your faculty person to write you back so quickly is just absurd. It's delightful. These faculty really try and help you understand the concepts. They'll go out of the way if you need extra study sessions. And the faculty person was wonderful. He's like, if you guys need extra help, uh, I'll meet with you on a Saturday. I'll do sort of a, a Zoom call or a uh, teleconference with you if you can't come to campus. So the support is just remarkable. They work really hard to get uh, internships for folks and they reach out and they're involved in the community and they try and get uh, DU uh, MLS students uh, out in the community working in actual library jobs to complement what they learn in the classroom. My title is Head Librarian, which might as well mean not cataloging and not circulation, but other things. So um, I do a lot with electronic resource management, um, I do acquisitions, and I do reference help. But a big part of librarianship is looking at spreadsheets and evaluating a collection um, and thinking about, uh, alright, so we have a particular resource in print, do we have it in line, online as well? What's the best way to get it to our community? So there's a lot of that kind of grunt work evaluation of collections. Um, furthermore, you have to learn certain software pieces. How do I operate an integrated library system? I'm helping them with a printer issue. A lot of people don't realize being a librarian means troubleshooting technology all the time. How do I interact with a library patron? If you're working in any kind of library, public or academic or special, you're gonna encounter people with different viewpoints than your own. And your job as a librarian is just to help them find what they need and not pass judgments, not try and steer them in the way that you want them to think. Um, but these, that's sort of some of the values of, of librarianship, which you kind of learn uh, both by practice, but especially in a classroom with experienced faculty who have been through it before. I've made some good relationships, which I think will be lasting relationships. That you're already building your professional network. And one thing that's great about librarians, especially librarians in your own cohort that you graduate with, we're all here to help one another. It's not competitive cut through, I gotta be better than you, it's how can I help you to be a better librarian? How can you help me to be a better librarian? And I met a lot of people in the MLS program who share those same values. Um, so those relationships are valuable, both personally and professionally.